Hey, what's going on, phone dogs? Bo HD here. I hope you guys are doing well. In this video, we're going to be talking about the OnePlus 5T. Now, if we take a step back, 2017 has been one of the biggest and best years for smartphones and smartphone displays in particular. When the OnePlus 5 launched, which is the device I have right here, less than six months ago, it had a premium build, had a fast processor and clean software to help it compete against the iPhone and Galaxy S8. But what it didn't have is a particularly noteworthy display. I mean, it features a pretty conservative 5.5 inch 1080p AMOLED display with pretty chunky bezels. The new and improved OnePlus 5T looks to significantly refresh that feature to uh, help narrow the gap between its competitors. The biggest new feature is rumored to be an edge to edge six inch display with a 2160 by 1080p resolution. So it looks to maintain the same 1080p resolution it's had for years with the exception uh, being more vertical pixels due to the 18 by nine aspect ratio. The build will resemble the OnePlus 5. It will have the uh, same aluminum build construction with curved edges. It'll have uh, the same dual camera sensor setup, uh, notification slider and bottom facing speakers. The fingerprint scanner will be located on the back above the OnePlus logo. That's really the only major uh, design change. I will add that there will be a 20 megapixel selfie camera on the front and just pretty similar specifications as the OnePlus 5. Uh, Octa-core Snapdragon 835 chipset with up to eight gigabytes of RAM and 128 gigabytes of internal storage. Now we don't have a confirmed price, but we can expect it to be priced very competitively uh, like all of the OnePlus devices to come before it. Um, a OnePlus fan asked, OnePlus's CEO whether or not $600 would be enough to buy the OnePlus 5T, and he said it would be enough. If I had to guess, the maxed out 128 gigabyte variant will be priced at about $600, while the 64 gigabyte model will be priced at about $539, but it's very possible it will be even less than those amounts. We'll have to just wait and see. I know the Essential phone just had a price drop to about $500, give or take, so um, it'll be interesting to see what the OnePlus 5T's price will be because uh, as you guys know, the Essential phone, its big selling feature is the edge-to-edge -edge display. And uh, that's gonna be the main selling feature of the OnePlus 5T. OnePlus officially announced the 5T on November 6th and said they will reveal the device in Brooklyn on November 16th at about 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, I'm a big fan of OnePlus and even though the 5T doesn't look like a huge improvement over the OnePlus 5, I can't wait to get my hands on it and test it out. Um, the OnePlus 5's software and performance are just fantastic even to this day. The only real thing that's holding it back is the, the rather chunky, outdated display. So if the 5T can fix that and keep the price relatively low, the company should definitely have a hit on its hands. With that said, guys, I really wanna hear your thoughts of the OnePlus 5T in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, maybe subscribe if you're brand new. As always, I'm BoHD from PhoneDog.com. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching, and I will see you right back here in the next one. See ya.